I am sick of you. Go away. What is the point of all of these treasures? What is the point of all of this power? If there's no one to pass it on to. But of course, my dear niece. for you. Ready, girls? One, two, three! How to spot your very friend among the hundreds of people. Ooh. Holy crackers! Auntie? You came here to visit me? Everyone, I'd like you to meet my auntie. She's the Snow Queen. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Valerie, and that's... Oh, I've read a lot about you in books. Dear, so this is your home. Well, these living arrangements are far beneath you, Snow Maiden. Not at all, auntie. This place is very cozy. We decorated mm. it with my friends. And what is this ridiculous trinket? It's a present from my bunny. He made it for me himself. That's a present? <laughs> now this is a present worthy of my dear niece. Now let's go, my Snow Maiden. All right. Your Majesty. Hey! Where are you going? Snowy! Oh my! What on earth just happened? Did you see how Snowy changed before leaving? It looks like the problem is the ice crown. Snowy was bewitched by she it. She was bewitched! Then we need to go save her! Helena, wait! Girls, I know what we should do. We need to get in touch with Santa Claus and tell him everything. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I recognize my sister. She was like that since childhood. Once, I received a reindeer as a present, and she... Listen, Santa Claus, this is all very interesting, but could you please tell us what we should do now? How do we get Snowy back? Will you help us? But of course, my dear girls, I'll help you. I know how to deal with her. Now, what did you say? This has to be delivered now? Look, girls, don't you worry. I'm gonna deliver this package and... Oh, wait, Santa Claus! Too late. He's gone. We can't wait. Not now. We are going to the Snowland. Look here, my Snow Maiden. The entire Snowland, with all its treasures and riches, will one day be yours. I will teach you to conjure blizzards and snowstorms. Yes, Your Majesty. We've arrived. The Snowland. Boy, it is freezing here. And that's the entrance. So let's just go already. I will reveal to you all the secrets of ice magic. 
One day you will become a great and powerful witch. And together, we will rule the entire North. Just you and I. As you command, Your Majesty. Rise, my winds and storms at once. Lift my foes up from the ground, from the coldest of the snow. Rise, my fearless snow patrol! Whoa, these snowmen are seriously enormous! Dear snowman, could you kindly let us through, please? No, girls, I don't think this is going so well. <laughs> My dear child, come closer to me. Yes, your majesty. Give us back our Snowy! She is our best friend. And you cast a spell on her! You want your Snowy back? All right. If you recognize which Snowy is yours, I will let her go. If you don't, she will stay with me forever! <laughs> They're completely identical. Mary, maybe there's a special spell we could use? I'm looking, but there's okay. nothing. Hey, How could I recognize my friends? <gasps> what was that? That was the song we wrote for Snowy. How to spot one of your very best friends among the hundreds of people. I think our song is what we need. To hold her hand tight and to walk by her side. Adorable little penguin. We did it! Snowy, our Snowy. Hey, that's not fair! You promised to let Snowy go if we recognized her. None of that matters. This is my kingdom, and your Snowy will stay with me. Well, we are gonna see about that. There, sister. Why are you acting up again? Brother, I want to make the child my successor. She will be happy here with me. Grandpa! Oh, sister, my sister. Do you really think you can make anyone happy against their will? Have you asked Snowy what it is that she wants? Tell me then, my dear Snow Maiden, don't you want to become a great and powerful Snow Queen like your dear auntie? Auntie, please don't take it personally, but I don't want to be a queen at all. I want to be with my friends and live in the world of humans. Thank you so much, Santa Claus. Your timing is perfect, because this lady is so mean. Well, actually, I don't think she's all that mean. She's just very lonely here, right, sister? So my auntie simply wanted to have a friend? Grandpa, tell me, do you only grant wishes on Christmas or other days too? Why, granddaughter? Do you have something particular in mind? In that case, I can grant your dearest wish right now. It's your birthday after all. Make a wish. I wish that my auntie the Snow Queen has a friend so she'll never feel lonely again. Holy oh, crackers! I'm no longer alone. <laughs> Thank you so much, sweet Snowy. Snowy, I'd like the biggest piece. After all these crazy adventures,
vultures. I'm really starving. I'll get it. <gasps> it's the snowman again. Stop right there. What do you need now? <laughs> Helena, seriously? It's just us. We came to congratulate Snowy. Snowy, happy birthday. Here, this is for you. It's ice cream. about how cool it must be to be a real queen. Hey, guys, look at that. Happy birthday, Snow Maiden. Our plans have changed. It's no longer your job to try and steal the keys from the keepers. You need to help them find the last one. Ignis Portas. The sacred gates of Sumeru open up. Don't move, Deva. I will not let you bring your fiery army in here. <laughs> and who's going to stop me, you little nothing? Keeper here, the town can sleep peacefully. I will be back. Don't get so upset. We'll find your bracelet. Anything? Nothing, girls. The Mirror of Prophecy didn't say anything useful about the bracelet. <sighs> the Wood Sprite doesn't know anything. Helena, don't be so sad. Your bracelet will definitely show up. But for now, look! You like dancing, right? Well, tonight, the park will be hosting this big dancing competition. You need a distraction, so I signed up all of us. Snowy! How can you talk about dances? I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> That's a wise choice. Better drop out from the start. You should see what Cody and I prepared. We are so gonna win. And why do you think that, I wonder? We would totally outdance you two, hands down and eyes closed. Hey, you shouldn't mess with her. Hmm. We'll see about that. See you at the dancing floor. Snowy? When exactly does the competition begin? Welcome to the Heroes of Earth HQ. Here I have a telescope, some aliens' portraits. This one is from Enceladus. I need the drawing. <laughs> I can tell. Listen, I think this is the perfect place where we can test this. What's that? A girl's bracelet? This isn't just a girl's bracelet, Cody. It's magical, and in a moment, it's gonna turn me into a real wizard. Watch me! Nothing? That's strange. I must have put it on the wrong side. There we go. Now look what happens. Alex, listen, it's nothing personal, but it's the final tournament of the chess club in half an hour. I've been preparing for it for six months. <sighs> Fine, Cody, go already. All right, then, I'm off. Just pull down the hatch when you leave. <sighs> See you tonight. Hmm, maybe I'm supposed to press something? <gasps> Whoa! Uh. Fire, fire, let the fire in. <sighs> this place gives me the creeps. Ah, uh, there you are. Did I really get it wrong and this is nothing more than just some kind of shiny, girly trinket? 
Oh, unbelievable. I made it work. Okay, we'll continue this at the dance. Well, here I come, fairies. We are now on equal terms. Ooh, I'm not late. Can you believe it? I actually won the final game. Well, almost. Hand me my fireballs. Oh, I think I forgot to bring them. You forgot to bring over my fireballs? Is there no brain in that head of yours? <gasps> oh! What? What's going on? Let's go! Look at how awesome we are! Way cooler than that Alex Lewis boy. By the way, can't see him anywhere. He probably chickened out and didn't come. <laughs> oh, there they are. They came after all. I've been waiting for this moment for so how long. How is he doing that? Mine now. It looks like it's some kind of magic. Fire is at my command. Helena, and I'll tell you I think he's wearing your bracelet. Magic is my passion. Magic is my thing. I have only one confession. I just want to be the king. Not again. What is he doing? No, without a doubt, this is the Phantom. <laughs> What? Who dares to interrupt my performance? The show has to continue! Here comes my day, here comes my hour. The vicious flames will give me What? Power. What was that? I didn't know the Phantom wields the magic of fire. Or this is not the magic Phantom. Is my passion. Magic is my thing. Unbelievable! This is the fiery Deva! I need to run straight to Fableton and get my magical sword! Dare you get in my way? I am the best! What's going on? I didn't mean to. No! It looks like something happened to Alex. Oh, where's Helena? Stop resisting me. Surrender your will. No! You need to go back to the cellar and let in the fiery army. No! I don't wanna! <laughs> Who are you trying to lie to? I can see. I see vanity. You want to be a wizard. You desire fame. I can give you all of that. Surrender to me! No! Aha! I got you! Elena. I'm sorry. I... I just wanted to become a wizard. Like you. What have you done to my bracelet? You dirty thief! How dare you, silly girl! Hey, hey! What's going on? No! Don't do it! Leave her alone! I'll do anything you want! Helena! Helena! Are you okay? And where's Alex? I don't think that was the real Alex. Peterson, start explaining what happened to him. And how would I know? At HQ today, he was playing with some bracelet. And then I went to the chess club and... Cody, where's your HQ? Hyper Hypolites, the gates to the world of fire open. Fantasy Patrol, you need to stop right now. <laughs> you can never stop the fiery Deva. My powerful army is coming. Hear that? Deva, that's a fiery genie. He's taken over Alex. And how are we supposed to stop him? It says here that we shouldn't make him angry. Anger only makes Deva stronger. All right. In that case, I'm gonna go try and talk to him. Helena, come back right now. Alex, it's me. I know you can hear me. Easy, easy. Everything's okay. Alex, I know that you really wanted to become a w w wizard. And that's why you took my bracelet. I get it. I was a regular girl my whole life. But you, you are a great guy without any magic. 
Remember that awesome fire show you did at the Magicians and Illusionists competition? That was without magic. I could never do that. And this evil is in the bracelet. Take it off, and then I'll be able to help you. Aha! I got you now, Deva! Ha ha ha! And this time, I will make you go away! Proper wizard, but I won't let you hurt her. You hear me? <laughs> Elena, please forgive me for the bracelet if you can, and thank you for saving me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mention it. That's our job, after all. We are the Fantasy Patrol. <laughs> Speaking of Fantasy Patrol, Alex, swear that you'll keep everything you saw today a secret. I swear. Not a word to anyone. No one's gonna believe it anyway. By the way, do you maybe need some help? Obviously, I'm not a wizard, but... We do. There's one job perfect for you. This one's not working. This one I wore already, and this one too. Valerie looks really nervous. I don't think I've ever seen her like this before. Of course she is. Valerie's gonna be hosting the party. This is so exciting. Exactly, hosting. And by the way, I'll have to announce Shikan himself. Shikan, music god and teenage girl's idol, unrivaled at playing magical guitar. Ugh, what a poser, he's just a guy. Looks pretty much like that show off Alex Lewis. I'm ready. How's this? Oh, Valerie, you look gorgeous. Among the common folk, our Valerie is always a queen. Oh, come on now, Mary. Snowy, did you explain to Peterson how to get to the masquerade? I did, and I gave him the invitation. I really don't understand why we invited Peterson to the magical masquerade at all. If it weren't for Peterson, Snowy would still be queen of the dwarves right now. And he is nice. He won't tell anyone about us. Peterson! Oh, there you are. Oh, I'm sorry. You know, I've figured it out. That bracelet, the one that Helena wears, that's what gives her magical powers. Anyway, I need to have that bracelet. You listening? Where are you going anyway? Since you're asking, I'm going fishing. Without a fishing rod? Invitation to the full moon masquerade ball. All witches and wizards are to arrive at 7 p.m. Witches and wizards? I'm gonna go. I don't want to be late to the library. Sure, Cody, go. Cody, you've lost something. Oh, that's just a flyer I got handed on the street. Heroes of Earth? Heroes of Earth. Whoa! Thank you, William. And now 
let's give a warm welcome to our guest from the magical forest. Give it up for Dryad! Valerie, Shikan is having some kind of troubles. He called to say he's running late, so now we need to stall. Uh huh. Hello, I'm here for the ball. Yeah. I was invited. Here. Come on in. Hey, how are you? Awesome costume. Your invitation. Invitation? Ah, right. Listen, buddy, the thing is that... I, I don't believe this! It's Shakan! I am first! Can you sign this for me? Uh, please? Not for you! For me! Stop pushing me! Uh, why are we still here? Everyone's waiting for you! Let's go! We'll show you the way! Excuse me, let me through, please. I cannot believe there are so many aliens on Earth. Excuse me. It's half past six already. Where's Shikan? Hey, everybody! Check out who I brought here! We brought here the superstar Shikan! Ta da! I'm a star? Why didn't I dress as Pinocchio or something like that? <laughs> Shikan, I'm Mary. I love, love, love your music. I'm Valerie. I'll be announcing you. Could I have seen you somewhere before? Your face looks really familiar. It's so weird. Helena, of course you've seen him on posters. All right, let's go to the stage now. Everyone's been waiting for you. Uh, to the stage? You know, my throat is feeling kind of... I think I'm going to get some water. I think this Shikan is quite odd. Celebrity. I'm in trouble. Celebrity? I need to change as soon as possible. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, were those doors walking by? Oh, dude, sorry. Oh, the incomparable Shikan! What a meeting! I'm your big and longtime fan. Could you sign this for me? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Can I get you something? My treat? How about water? Sparkling water. You're embarrassing me. No, you're embarrassing oh, no. me. Those two again. I need to hide. Here's your water. Uh, where are you going? Girls, are you sure Shikan is coming? I'm gonna go look for him. Hey, girls. Here I am. Well, finally. Follow me to the stage. The audience is waiting. I would love to, beautiful, but it's not gonna work. The battery in my magical guitar is out of juice. What a nightmare. I was trusted with such a big, important event, and now it's going up in smoke. I have a question. Shouldn't there be some kind of way to charge this battery of yours? I doubt there's anything suitable here. We would need artifacts of the elements. Artifacts of the elements? Like our bracelets? Bracelets? I guess bracelets could actually work. Snowy, the keys are a serious matter. You shouldn't just use them for no reason. Mary, please, I'm begging you. It's our last chance. Without Shikan, this evening is over. Come on, Mary, say yes! Mary, please, let us try. Uh, I don't know. We are talking about the keys. Thank you so much! So you start working on it, and I'm gonna buy us some time. Drakey, come! I mean, there's no need to worry. It's only for a brief moment. <laughs> Awesome. All done. It's charged. Here you go. Wait, where are you going? What about the show? While your friend is out on the stage, I'm gonna get some water. And once I'm back, I'm gonna rock this place. I hate to bother you, Shikan, but are you okay there? Hey, buddy. One water here. Mr. Shikan, but you've just gone to... Ah, wizardry. What a trickster you are. Here. It's sparkling water. You don't have still water. What? But you specifically asked. Ugh, these celebrities, they're so spoiled. All right, here you go. Still water, just as you ordered. Still water? But I ordered sparkling water. What? 
Sparkling water? But you've... Ah, I hate celebrities. They don't even know what they want. Oh, there you are. We've been looking for you. Come with us, please. Valerie is at her wit's end with that performance. Here. Oh, I hate celebrities. Ugh. And here's another joke. One hero fought and slayed a dragon, but when he actually saw the princess, he just said, Oh, why did I hurt that poor animal? Start getting ready. It's your turn now. Snowy, how does it look? Not so good, girls. We need to run intervention. Right. Go get Valerie from the stage, and I'll keep an eye on this showman and make sure he doesn't try to escape it. Uh, all right. I'll have to play. Maybe they won't notice. Oh, wow. What is this from? It looks exactly like that bracelet. <laughs> Valerie, it's time to go. Shikan is ready. And here's another one. One day, Drakey comes to school. Done. They got her. We're clear. It's your cue. Hey, I haven't even started yet. You're totally missing out, buddy. What a day. I'm sorry, could I get some water? Still water. Oh, you want water? Still water? But of course, I'll be right there. Here's water for you, all you can drink. <laughs> Please accept my most sincere apologies. This was just a misunderstanding. All these shikans coming in. Okay, we'll have to deal with all the other shikans later, but right now, we need to keep the concert going. It's time to rock this place. Uh, maybe some water? Still water. What are we gonna do with this thing? The last Shikan just left it here. Whoa! Listen, girls, it looks like you've lost something. I have obtained all three keys of the elements for you. Uh, uh, I mean to say that I will obtain them very soon. They're not real. It's a fake. Fantasy Patrol, you need to be more careful. And you should take better care of such powerful artifacts. Where's mine? Got married. Yellow? Well, uh, she fell asleep. <laughs> and you, Green? She's too much food. <sighs> huh? I did it! I got one! Good at rollerblading. If you want, we can practice it together. Helena gave me a couple of lessons. Wow, I'm doing it! Finally! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Thank you so much. Listen, what do alien girls think about eating ice cream? Well, I don't know about aliens, but I would love to have one right now. Creme brulee would be great. Creme brulee? That's my favorite too. You just. Don't go anywhere, okay? I'll be right back. I'll be quick. One moment. He's <laughs> such a funny guy. Ah, Cody! Oh, Snowy? 
Snowy! Where are you? Snowy, I'm coming! I'm here! Oh, what if there are aliens there? I don't even have a blaster. What should I do? Helena, I can't believe it. Five hot dogs in one sitting. That wasn't me! Hey, you! Come here! And hurry! This is where she was dragged to. I wanted to go in, but my mom doesn't allow me to climb into wells and pits. Okay, all right. Entry 37. Snowy was kidnapped by dwarves. The question is why. We need to figure it out. Let's go. And me? What should I do? And you, Peterson, stay here. Guard the hole. Here. This is also for you, Your Majesty Snowy White. Thank you, kind dwarves. The gems are really pretty, but I'm not Snow White. I'm simply Snowy. Oh. Your Majesty, please don't go. Stay here with us, kind Snowy White. We really, really like you. <laughs> Dear dwarves, I cannot stay here. But maybe you can be our guest for just a little bit. Pretty, 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 please. <laughs> All right, dear dwarfs, I will stay with you till the evening. This place looks nice. And what is this? Oh, this is the royal ruby. The biggest and most beautiful ruby in the world. In the past, it used to be the most important treasure of our kings. But then it disappeared. We've been looking for it ever since. But we still cannot find it. Oh, wow! This is what I call a big cave. A fellow walked along the road, and then he saw a piece of gold. He bought a violin and a bow. Dance now, Snowy, dance now. <laughs> oh, what is that? That's uh, nothing important. Something must have broken in the tunnel. We're going to fix it. Snowball by Bunny Lip. He loved his mistress oh so what? Bunny is cute, Bunny is cute. Dance now, Snowy, dance now. Bearded creatures. This is King Glom the Third. Helena, actually, we came here to rescue Snowy. Quiet. Do you hear that, girls? Aha! Dwarves! Yeah. <laughs> you have kidnapped our Snowy. Tell us where she is this instant. Uh, it wasn't us. It's all those pestilent miners. What miners are you talking about? We saw them dragging away this little girl. She had blonde hair. If you want, we can show you the way. And you guard the hole. You think I'm a coward? No. Cody Peterson will show you what he can do. The hero of Earth. Let's go. <laughs> There, we've arrived. The miner's cave is at the bottom. This way. Wow. Wow, that is really deep. Thank you. Helena, you should go first. Oh, I can't see anything. <laughs> hey! <laughs> you two-faced liars, ugly, wicked dumplings. You're gonna pay for this! <laughs> This place must be an abandoned mine. Oh, right, all right, all right. There has to be a way out. Oh, Valerie, do you think that you could maybe teleport us out of here? No, Helena. Teleportation doesn't work underground. No, but that means that we're going to be stuck in this place forever. <laughs> Calm down, Helena. I've got an idea. Mine carts. They can take us out. We just need to get this gate to open. And how are we going to get it open? We need to fire up this boiler. not working at all. Mary, you have the key of the earth. Ha, that's right! Come on, tell these stupid stones they need to move. Okay, I'm gonna try. Okay. 
It's my turn. I'm gonna get this switch. I don't believe it. I guess this is an underground alien base, and these are definitely their leaders. <laughs> hmm, and what is this thing here? I bet it's something extraterrestrial. You? Peterson? What are you doing here? I came here to save Snowy! Just look at this, Savior! It's ending! Thank you, dear dwarfs, but I should go. Huh? Oh, lovely Snowy White, why don't you stay with us a little longer? Huh? <laughs> well then, the wish of our queen is our command. If you want to go home, we'll show you the way. Get away from me! We arrived. Yeah, and apparently it's the final station. <laughs> I've got you now, you dirty liars. You're going to regret what you've done. Start telling us where Snowy is. Her Majesty Snowy White is ours. You will never be able to find her. No one can find a way out of our caves. <laughs> there has to be something we can do. I have an idea. All right, girls. Give me all the valuables you've got on you. These are dwarves. They'll give up everything for shiny trinkets. Here, we're exchanging these treasures for our Snowy. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you're calling treasures? Uh, this is worthless trash. Here, to save Snowy, I will do anything. <gasps> is this really the royal ruby? We've been looking for you for centuries. You've, You've returned, returned to us. us. Not so fast. How about first you give us our Snowy? <laughs> Regret what you've done! Peterson, swear that you won't talk to anyone about what you saw. I swear. No one will believe me anyway. All right. We should go now, girls. Snowy! I wanted to ask, can extraterrestrial girls be friends with boys from this planet? Extraterrestrial? <laughs> but of course, Cody. <gasps> Thank you for your help. This isn't a mistake. Is this the right place? In its riddle, the Mirror of Prophecy said that the key is located in the magic forest. Uh, it doesn't look very magical to me. Quite stunt. Quiet, everyone. Hear that? Coming from there. Hey, you! 
Leave that bunny alone! Or else you'll be dealing with us! Vieka info! Usalion vitale pochti! But this is. Ayaya Gakilev! Morim zi sirpim! Wow! Mary knows another language? Yeah, Mary was a straight A student in magical languages. In zish kavaret ogligos, in the rot, dina vasoso, igasotos. Teu, bilitokiabi, si varpsi mizomim kak. Utov yisarev, inirp, timbigo pasisal em vasisim. Min isafid if ah. Mary, Mary, hey, what did she say? Apparently, this is Dryad, the guardian of the magic forest. That bunny is a villain who damaged the Tree of Life. The forest is dying. So it was the Phantom? But we didn't know. Mary! You should tell her that we didn't mean to! We are the Fantasy Patrol! She doesn't believe us. So now I have to go and bring the Water of Life. Otherwise, you'll stay in the forest forever. Fluffy, you can come out. Huh. So where are we supposed to look for that water of life? Okay, let's see. Aqua Vivum. All right. H2O. Argentum. Okay. Oh, I get it. The water of life is supposed to give off invisible shining. Well, that's just great. If the water is invisible, how are we supposed to see it? We need to get to a higher ground. Aseltam. Overhead Ikelove. Sun, he got the open. Hey, pal. Psst. What is she doing? I don't know. Making some kind of spell, I think. She's probably trying to help the tree. <laughs> you know, Mary, I'm a mouse, not a squirrel. Come on, Fluffy, don't be scared. We can see the entire forest from here. All right. There. Got it. Ah! Ah! What if Mary doesn't find that water? What's gonna happen? Nothing much. She just turn us into tree stumps. Oh, but I don't want to be a tree stump. Quiet. Hear that? Someone's coming. <gasps> That's the wood sprite. Hello, over here. Help us! itote. <laughs> We're here. The water should be somewhere close. <laughs> oh, hello there. We're looking for the water of life. Do you know where we can find it? <laughs> of course I do. Why wouldn't I? I've been guarding it uh, for about three centuries. I'm sorry, but we really need the water of life. You see, there's this tree, and it's dying. Just look at her go. No water for you, period. I said period. Is that so? In that case, we'll take it ourselves. Like some buffoon can stop us. <coughs> what are you doing? This is for the magical tree. If the tree dies, the whole forest will go down with it. <coughs> <laughs> Hilarious. Haven't had so much fun in a while. Just you wait. I'll show him. I'll make that whistler pay. Ugh. Wait now, Fluffy. We cannot do it by force. We need a method. Huh? Tell me, young lady, what is this marvelous music? Huh, this? These are masters of musical whistling. Internet celebrities, by the way, very well known. Hmm, impressive. What a show. And I can do this. There, all done. Whoa. 
Wow, that's a lot of comments. You made a great show. What's that now? Is that addressed to me? Yes, look how many fans you've got already. Mr. Whistler, so how about that water of life? Uh, the shelf. You'll see it there. Thank you, Mr. Whistler. Good afternoon, my dear fellow. Ooh, where's the W? Hmm? Ha! 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 Ten! Galadoka ti sandit! Sivorofes gadle i! We should have asked Mr. Whistler for an autograph. What if he actually becomes famous? Quiet. Hear that? Someone's moaning. Oh, a deer. You poor thing. Hang in there, sweetie. We're gonna help you. Fluffy, we're gonna save him. Yeah, but what about the girls? <sighs> ha! Ha! The key should be somewhere here. <laughs> Stop it! Don't you dare kill that tree! You're hurting it! I wish I had my bracelet! Then I could stop all of this! Oh, girls. Dryad. This is bad. Phantom's back. The keys! Fluffy, I know what to do. We'll get help from Mr. Whistler. Stop, Phantom! Ha! And who's gonna stop me? You? Pipsqueak? Ha <laughs> No, Mary! Run! You can't do it alone! Good thing I'm not alone. Mr. Whistler, it's your cue! Huh? All right, I guess you won. But I will be back! you Water? I'm afraid I don't have any water left. I'm so sorry. Dear, you came here? This is... But this is the spirit of the forest. Please rise, my child. For your kind heart and your pure soul, I entrust you with the key of the earth. Take good care of it, and use it only for honorable deeds. Thank you so much, Mighty Father. Of night, 
A spark of consciousness in the toy light. Oh! And it worked. Let's see. Come over here. Neither Tweedledee nor Tweedledum. Don't do anything rash, Snow Maiden. I have a surprise for you. Funny? Alive? Yes, I brought him to life. And unless you bring the magical keys to the abandoned toy factory, you will never see your bunny. of pillow fighting. <laughs> Take this! Uh, uh, no way, Valerie! Using magic is against the rules. Well, I'm gonna teach you a lesson. <laughs> Ow! You're behaving like kids. Ow! Oh, I'm not gonna let this slide. Uh, ow! Take this! <laughs> <laughs> Why are you sitting there? Come join us. Oh. Hey, go away! Valerie, do something about this big eater. He's got his paws on the cake. Oh, the cake. Drakey, go to your place. Helena, shall we go set off some fireworks? And eat cake? So pretty. Okay, do it, Helena. It's a good time to see you launch those magical sparks. Okay, one sec. Oh, I forgot the sample to my purse. My poor bunny. Oh, I love you so much. But if I give the keys to the Phantom, Helena will never be able to go to the fairy tale world and find her parents. No, I cannot do it. Bunny, 
I will save you myself. Snowy, are you serious? You really wanted to go fight the Phantom on your own? And you thought we'd let you go alone? Oh, girls, I'm so sorry, but he's got my bunny. Wait, what bunny? Snowy's bunny. Cheer up. We'll get him back. Do you roger me, girls? I'm at the place. How's the picture? Snowy, the picture's good. You can go in, but be careful. Can't see anyone so far. <gasps> So, Snow Maiden, <laughs> as you see, I kept my word. But do you have the keys? Yes, I do. Here! Put them in here. Snowy, try to find out where the Phantom's hiding. He must be somewhere close. Where is he? Where is he? Aww, we're gonna lose our keys! Looks like there's some movement on the right side. Snowy, turn around. That way. Let's teleport there. Valerie, grab it! <laughs> Helena, catch! Take this, Phantom! No one's here. So where's the Phantom? She obviously got scared and ran away. That's strange. I didn't expect it to go this easy. My bunny! Tricky, what are you doing? This is my bunny! Tricky, hush! Go to your place! Come on, Tricky, don't be jealous. I love you just as much. It's so strange. The bunny's alive now. Where have you been all this time? Quite a traveler. Thank you so much, girls. You don't know how happy this makes me. Okay, missies, let's start tea partying already, because uh, I'm getting very sleepy weepy. <laughs> Bring them to me. Bring me the bracelets. everyone just sleep at night. First, they bring home pets, and now I'm the one who has to look after this bunch of weird creatures. <laughs> Finally, the keys are mine! <laughs> Get away from me, you flying piece of lizard! Drakey, I guess I should start working on making you a real fighter dragon. <laughs> Bunny, what's wrong with you? It looks like your bunny has been bewitched. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
Okay, all right. The Siren's Magical Ribbon. Capable of taking the free will from any creature. Powerful thing. Ah! And now it's gone. This powerful thing. <laughs> uh. Come on. Our home has become some sort of magical zoo. <laughs> She found herself in Toastville in a snap. Simply extraordinary. It's not usually very scary. Maya, Nick, B and Bo, Muffy and Sonia. Sonia from Toastville. The price you pay. Hey gang, it's Sonia here. Today I needed to get a present for a friend, which became a way bigger challenge than expected. No, no. I'm not sure he likes this kind of stuff. It's the first birthday present I've given Muffy. It's a big deal, so it has to be special. Toastville time for Sonia! First stop, the Toastville Shopping Center. You can find almost anything there. Hey there, you two. You shopping for Muffy's present? Hey there, Sonia. We are. Oh, my toast. I've already found mine. And it's the coolest present ever. Ta-da! <gasps> Catch them quickly! <laughs> I thought you wanted those to record videos from a bird's eye view, right? Oh, uh, yeah. I was hoping he'd, you know, lend them to me. We found nothing at all. We can't think of anything. Then let's work together to find something. Oh, we don't want Muffy to see. Oh, uh, don't worry about that. Nick's got his full attention. Hey, you ready for some Banana Borders Extreme Action Sports? Jump in, it's showtime! <laughs> uh, it's been over an hour and we found nothing we might like. Hmm. Ooh, what about this cool hat? Nothing doesn't, you know, wear hats. Hey, put me down this instant. I sell hats. I'm not for sale, I'll have Oops, you know. Oops, I'm really sorry. Outrageous. <laughs> Why do people keep putting me on? Birthday shopping is exhausting. Hey, hey! <gasps> Need something special? I've got the most unique, memorable presents in Toastville right here today, right now! Oh, look at those! What's in the boxes? These are miracle boxes! Each one has the most amazing, astounding, stupendous surprise inside! Cool, how about a stone that turns into a flower? <laughs> into a flower, a flower pot, or even a 50-foot yacht if you want. Oh, how about never-ending scoops of ice cream with fudge on top? With fudge on top, a chocolate drop, and a wet, smelly mop, too. <laughs> Anything you like. You never know what you'll find in a miracle box. Ooh, I don't know. Sounds a bit fishy to me. I will take one. A payment first, okay? Sure thing. How much for it? Oh, not much. Nothing too costly. One teensy little bit of meanness. No meanness? You bet. Just a tiny bit. A practical joke, if you like. And the box is yours. Oh, if it's only a joke. I don't like this. Of course you don't. You already got a present. Hmm. Uh, it's so hot today. <gasps> oh, this will cool you down. Oh, thank you. <gasps> <laughs> Each joke adds dough and stacks of boxes grow. <laughs> see? Easy as one, two, three. Now let's see. <laughs> it's a Happy Stones ball cap. I've wanted one forever. You see? Just one joke with a little bit of meanness. Can I have some shampoo, please, and thanks? 
When someone's acting mean, my bank is full of greed. <laughs> that was really so mean of you two. I mean, really good job. Here you go. Oh, it's Rumble Crush. The new game he wants so badly. <laughs> yes, only a tiny bit of meanness can lead to so much joy. Oh, well, I guess if it brings happiness, it can be a good thing. Yep, you should try it. I'm so sorry. This kid's meanness adds some extra greenness. So much meanness delivered with such a smile deserves a special reward. <sighs> it's the latest Toast phone. They're not even officially released in stores yet. <sighs> oh, hey, you guys, we still haven't found a present for Muffy. How about this one here? No, 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 no. You have to be super mean to get this super fabulous box. <laughs> Not bad. And how about a bigger box? You'll have to come up with a way more extreme mean joke to get it. Hang on a minute. What about our very own pro prankster? <laughs> and then I do a kickflip. Look, check it out. <laughs> so rad. Nick isn't answering. If Nick won't come to the phone, then we gotta go to Nick. <laughs> Ooh. Muffy, hang out. Be right back. <laughs> What's up, Sonia? Did you find a present? Yes, and it's the best one ever. But to get it for him, we have to do a super seriously mean joke. Got it? Uh, like a really naughty prank. Oh, okay. You came to the right place. One sec. Muffy, I just gotta go to the park. And give me the last balloon. <laughs> A genius at work. Right, all done. I thought up this prank ages ago, but I was saving it for a special occasion. Someone just has to sit on the bench and... <laughs> huh? Nick? Nick, where are you? I think he said something about the park. But I was saving it for a special occasion. Someone just has to sit on the bench and... <laughs> Oh, excellent, very good. When it works, you'll get your big box at once. Guys, I'm getting us all Sparkle Splash sodas to celebrate getting Muffy's gift with a seriously cool and brilliant joke on someone else. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. Sparkle Splash soda is my fave. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> a really mean outcome is my best source of income. Wonderful. An oldie but a goodie. <laughs> wasn't part of the deal. <laughs> Not with you it wasn't, but with them it was. <laughs> Don't take it personally. It's just that meanness is my whole business. Here, have a towel. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Here you go, my friend. When someone plays a prank on you, it's not very cool at all. Yeah, no more mean tricks, please. Yes. Uh, guys, we've still got one more mean old trick left. Remember? The park! Uh, where's he got to? Get off the bench, Muffy! No! What? Grab him! He's flying away! Guys, help! Get me down from here! This wasn't a very good way of getting a present. Present? Oh, that's it! Maya, give me your present! Present? Why, see you? <gasps> of course! Uh, 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 careful, Sonia! Careful! Uh, 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 Mommy, grab hold! Uh, 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 Muffy's only 
They say experiences make the best presents. <laughs> and that was enough experience to last me a lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for saving me. And Nick, thanks for not playing any of your pranks on me today. Uh, no probs. Hey, how about a party? Hey, hey, what a sweet deal. <laughs> oh, 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 what unexpected meanness. <laughs> Murphy, that was a great party. I'm off now. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Home time for Sonia. You can't make someone happy at the expense of someone else's unhappiness, even as a joke or prank. And so that was how the day ended. Yes, Yuri from Toronto, I've still got the Happy Stones ball cap, but no, I'm not gonna sell it. Sorry. <laughs> I'm out. See ya. Bye-bye. Freedom and conscience, reasons to say. Friendship and goodness are the price you pay. Childhood and to play. <laughs>